Welcome to Voice and Live. In this video, we will show you how to create and deploy an inbound application. Inbound management is found within the Setup tab, then PBX. To start, we'll create some extensions for our agents. These extensions can be dialed at any time by callers after reaching your inbound number. We'll use 800 for our first agent. and assign an agent to that number. Make sure you click save when you are done. You can add as many extensions as you want. Although for now we will only assign two extensions. Next we'll add an extension group. Extension groups allow you to direct callers to a group of agents, such as sales or support agents. You can add multiple agents to an extension group. You can also include the same agent in multiple groups with some extensions and extension group setup. It's time to design our inbound application. This page is where you can manage your inbound applications. This is also where you can find your shared or purchased inbound phone number. The auto attendant section allows you to create your own customized inbound application. If we want callers to hear audio upon connecting, such as an explanation of their options, we can choose an audio file here. You can upload your own audio file by clicking the button at the top right. Then we simply choose which options the caller has. A transfer to extension option will directly transfer the call to the agent, as opposed to a queued transfer, which will place the call in a queue where the agent can choose to answer the call or not. You can add multiple choices by picking different numbers to press. A transfer to group will transfer the call to the chosen group. A queued transfer will direct the call to a queue where anyone in the group can answer the call. Keep in mind that once the caller presses one of these buttons, the action is executed immediately. Instead of a number you can choose enter an extension. This will enable callers to dial the extensions directly instead of pressing one or two etc. Make sure you save before leaving this page. Now after creating the application we need to set it as our inbound app. You can choose which days and times your applications are active. Here we'll select the application we just created. This is useful for having a different message for after hours when your agents may not be active. The different date groups enable you to have different applications for differing parts of the week. For example, you may not be open on the weekend. So we can set do not answer when our company isn't active. When making changes, make sure you click save when you are finished. And that's it. We have created and deployed an unbound application. Thank you for watching. Visit our website for more information and helpful videos.